and the area. Pretty neat. I wonder if she ever comes back to visit. <laughs> yeah, I would, I would hope so. This is a wonderful place. Yeah, a nice place to call home for sure. Come back to her uh, hometown. <laughs> not the nicest Sunday out there. Mm. Hopefully not a total washout, but definitely some rain to start off. To yep. start us off. That's right, Chloe. As we look live right now from Talladega Super Speedway, notice the track down below already wet early on this race day. So let's check out the radar and get right to it. Uh, we do have rain now just east of Talladega uh, where that rain moved through earlier. Uh, now Aniston, Oxford, Jacksonville, uh, Piedmont over to uh, Alexandria, just east of Ohatchee. I kind of have some showers right now uh, around Ohatchee. Back down to Alineville in Clay County, uh, Wedowie, Roanoke uh, there in Randolph County. Also Cleburne County. This is moving in your direction toward the Georgia state line. Not severe, uh, but farther to the south, we do have a, a good soaking rain falling uh, from Mobile back up toward uh, Montgomery. So as we look at the future cast, uh, we're getting a, a little bit of a lull there around the, uh, the Talladega Super Speedway. But as we get into this afternoon, just around race time at one o'clock, we will have some heavy downpours moving through. So downpours at times uh, through this evening, there's a good possibility that we'll have some delays within that race, but it's not going to rain constantly, but we will have to deal uh, with periods of rain with a few thunderstorms and even uh, into the day tomorrow as well. So here's the forecast for the Yellowwood 500 at one o'clock. Now here's the good news. The temperatures will hold in the 70s thanks to the clouds and the showers that we'll have, uh, but there's the possibility for rain at any point and we will have periods of rain uh, throughout this afternoon and that includes uh, the Yellowwood 500. Uh, right now the temperatures starting out fairly warm and muggy. Hamilton now 68 back down to Birmingham along I-22 and uh, Interstate 20, 59, 65, uh, 71 degrees. Uh, Talladega coming in in the upper 60s uh, to near 70. So your forecast for today uh, will have periods of rain, a few thunderstorms, but the good news, we're not expecting anything in the way of severe weather today. But the, the temperatures holding in the mid to upper 70s, between around 75 uh, to 80 degrees, depending on your location. And over the next several days, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, a stalled front uh, will initiate periods of thunderstorms each and every day, especially uh, during the afternoon hours. Now, we can't completely rule out the possibility for a little bit of flash flooding just because uh, the, the ground will remain fairly saturated. So for today, rain and thunderstorms continuing, tropical-like downpours, a South wind will keep us warm and muggy uh, from around 5 to 10 miles per hour. Over the next five to seven days, the temperatures will eventually uh, taper back down into the upper 70s uh, by uh, Thursday and Friday as we begin to dry out. So if you're listening to us from Talladega Super Speedway, make sure you have our CBS 42 app downloaded. News, sports, weather, all that within that same app. You can track the radar uh, to see these thunderstorms firing up this afternoon uh, throughout that race. Chloe. Definitely handy for a day like today. Thanks, Michael. Your